Hey all signs and welcome to Black Astrology. In this video, we will talk about what your moon sign means. This is a question that I literally get on a daily basis in my DMs. By the end of this video, you will understand yourself a little bit better or you will understand whoever else a little bit better. In this video, you will see celebrities and influencers with your moon sign. My videos are created so that you can get comfortable with your energy and feel yourself with no apologies. My Virgo mind because he's a Leo and his what's your sign? Pisces. He always say, I know how Sagittarius is. Right? I mean, Pisces are known to be very deep, very emotional. But it's like, you gotta step out that shit, we Leo. Think, baby, I'm Aquarius. I started this game to shit. It's an Aquarius and a Scorpio. Okay. So I say, is it, is it a Sagittarius? Thing? So, what is your moon sign? Your moon sign is the sign that the moon was in when you were born. This is why the time of birth is so important for an accurate birth chart. Your moon describes how you react, and this can be how you react towards other people, how you react to situations, etc. This placement basically identifies your deeper emotions. The moon can also give an idea of how you view your mother or the relationship between you and your mother. If you don't have a mother, it will be whoever the feminine energy is who raised you up. For men or masculine energies, their moon sign represents the energy that they want their wife to have. And they try their best to hide that. For women or feminine energies, your moon sign represents the woman you will eventually evolve into because it reduces the ego. If you want to know how someone else really feels, go straight to their moon sign, period. Okay, my Aquarius moon energies, I love y'all. I don't know about y'all, but anyone who can react with low emotions is a breath of fresh air. But that's just me. I love air sign moons. My daughter has a Libra moon. Aqua moons are a little bit too unpredictable for me though. But anyway, these people have a lot of damn friends. Even people who they just met are their friends. Nah, I'm just playing. But for real, these people never give up because they can always see a better way to do something. And when I say never, I mean never. They can go a little overboard trying to prove they can be different from everybody else. This will straight up, they will straight up tell you, I don't do what everybody else do, period. They never want to depend on nobody and this makes them the most independent moon in the Zodiac. Don't argue with me either. Go argue with your daddy. Not only are they very independent, but they will expect for everyone to be independent around them. Do not, under any circumstances, obligate an Aquarius moon because their natural reaction will be to leave your ass. So, we have definitely re reached the end of the video. Um, you should now have a better understanding on the way you react if you, or the way somebody else is reacting to you. Um, if you need more personal information or if you have a specific question, hit us up. If it resonated, please like and share to help somebody else. Check the description box for all our contact info. Oh, and about the 2024 love reading for Valentine's Day? I definitely forgot, but I will put something together for love readings. Um, also, the 10K subscriber giveaway will be in March. So, stay tuned and keep an eye out on our community tab. Seriously. And that's good for me because I'm a Sagittarius moon, honey. Yes, I am very into astrology.